Hi guys, did you know that you can now send and receive payments on WhatsApp? That's right. Just like Google Pay or Paytm, WhatsApp has joined the trend and has made transactions easier for you. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can use WhatsApp payment feature step by step, which means you can start sending and receiving payments to your contacts directly from WhatsApp in no time. Also, if someone is not in your contacts, no worries. I'll show you how you can send payments to them as well. It's easy. Now, whether you're an iOS or an Android user, setting up WhatsApp payments is almost the same process. So just make sure you're on the latest version of the app and let's get started. I'm Brian from Website Learners and let's see how you can send and receive payments on WhatsApp. First, we need to set up the payment method on WhatsApp. So to do that, let's open WhatsApp on your phone and click here. On iOS, you can click settings. Then click on payments and click on add payment method. Now click continue and here we need to select the bank which we are using. So just select the bank and then it'll ask you to verify your phone number. Make sure you're using WhatsApp on the same number which you used for your bank account. Only then you will be able to add your bank account on WhatsApp. So let's click verify. Click allow. Again click allow and finally click verify. Now you can see that our phone number has been verified and we've got a bank account. Now on iOS, when you verify your phone number, it will ask you to send a message from your phone like this. So you can just click send and your phone number will be verified. Okay, now once you verified your phone number and you've got your bank account, just click add and click done. As you can see, we have successfully set up the payment method on WhatsApp. You can repeat the same steps to add multiple bank accounts. So next, let's see how you can send payments to your contacts on WhatsApp. Now, Before sending a payment to someone, make sure they also have WhatsApp payments set up on their phone. Only then we will be able to make the payment. So to send the payment, let's go back to our chats and search for the person to whom you want to send the payment. Now open the chat. And here you can see that we have the payment icon. So let's click on it. And here you need to enter the amount you want to send. If you want, you can also add a note here. Now click next. Then click send payment. And click continue. Now you can use the same UPI pin which you already have from other apps like Google Pay or Phone Pay. If you don't have a UPI pin, you need to create one and enter it here. I'm going to enter my pin and click here. Now as you can see, we have successfully sent the payment to that person and they will receive it directly to their bank account. Now here you can see that we have got a message from our bank saying the amount has been debited from our account. So this is how you can send payments to your WhatsApp contacts and you can also receive payments from them. On iOS, you can make payments in the same way. Now you know how to send payments on WhatsApp from both iOS and Android. And the best part is you can also send payments to anyone just by scanning the WhatsApp QR code. To do that, click here and click payments. Now here, click on scan payment QR code. Now the receiver should do the same steps and here they need to click on my code. Now with your phone, just scan the QR code. And here you can see the name of the person to whom you're going to send the payment. Now enter the amount you want to send. Click next. And click send payment. Now enter your UPI pin. And click here. As you can see, we have successfully sent the payment by scanning their WhatsApp QR code. This is how you can send payments by scanning their WhatsApp QR code. Okay, so that's it guys. This is how you can send and receive payments on WhatsApp. Now, if you're running a business and want to create a WhatsApp business account like this, you can do that by watching this video. And if you want to learn more about WordPress, you can check out our complete WordPress course by clicking here. Also, make sure you click the subscribe button to see more videos from us. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.